Okay, so we are playing the wolf and the bear. This one will be quite rough. Let's see how it goes. Yeah, there's not much content around, so I appreciate your offer very, effort very much. Mate, I appreciate your support. <laughs> if that makes sense. Naga, it's, it's perfect. Nice, okay, gotta go. Well, good luck and thank you for turning in. Appreciate it, man. Oh, damn, that's a nice spawn. Because I can go ahead and mine already. So... Let's mine right away. And go for a really, really fast relic. Yeah, but the raven, raven spawn is nice. Should be enough. Okay, obviously in a raven game, this tile is pretty bad. But we should be fine. Also, hi Afira! <laughs> welcome to YouTube! <laughs> welcome, welcome. I try to read like YouTube chat as well. Um, but hit me up if I, if I kind of forget sometimes. That's really nice. That's really, really, really nice. Let's go for a forge next. Go for some skulls. Actually, one skull should be enough because I will definitely house myself here. There's my lore. There's dwarves on map as well. Let's forge the skulls and then forge the relic. And obviously like go for a house later, but um the first like the biggest thing I wanna do is click the relic ASAP. Lars, hello snack. Welcome, welcome. So the stack got nerfed. Yep, the stack got nerfed. Really big. Really big nerf, actually. So, let's start with the jar, go with the house, and then after the house, get a war camp out, clear myself, take all the tiles, and then I should be quite ready. Obviously, I don't need the skulls right now, because I'm housed anyway. <clears throat> but this relic timing is insane. I have no idea what the raven does. Like why why does he doesn't he go for middle? <laughs> That's so weird. Oh, but anyway. 
Okay, so this is the bear spawn because of the pond there. So, actually what I want to do, I want to build a war camp. Get one warrior out, colonize this and build my, build my woodcutter there. Should be the best thing. Still OP or just decent? It's it's just decent. It's just decent. Yes, I'll get on Twitch link. It's easier for you. Thank you, man. <laughs> Appreciate it. Um, and also, thank you for the follow. Let's see if I can... Uh, Bcap 9k. Welcome, welcome. Um, maybe I can do the challenges the way so that you can probably take a look at it because it's really hard to read like this thank you for the follow y2k38 welcome welcome Man, I really struggle to to read out your names. I'm so sorry about that. <laughs> but I'm giving it my best. <clears throat> I promise. But mate, like this this jar um will will be insane. This jar set up. So let's go ahead and clear myself really really quickly. I need this tile ASAP. Also, I need to feast. Oh wow. Damn, this will be hard. Can they just return to smithing? What the hell? Okay, this will be like borderline impossible to do now. Yeah. No shot. Let's actually do that with the um, with the chief later on. Should always be got bodyguard here. Yeah, let's mine myself. Get the chief out with the iron. I should delete my scout camp here. <clears throat> no point in keeping that. There's no ruin or shipwreck around. <clears throat> but yeah. Let's mine the stone next. Finish mining the iron, because the iron mine has a lot of upkeep actually. What the hell? They had. I'm pretty sure they increased the upkeep on that. But yeah, get the lore circle. And then I should be fine. There's also like only one food tile for me at the moment. Like this is my this is my second food tile. This is my fish, which is pretty annoying considering that I that I'm forging jar right now. Okay, question is now: Do I want to go for shipbuilding or do I want to go for coinage? It looks like a coinage game for me actually. I mean, there's two potential ships, so two ships is okay. Let's not be too greedy here. But yeah, the winter will be quite rough with only um, one food tile. Let's see how it goes. Um, so yeah, finishing the iron, then reassigning these two bad boys to be villagers again. This minus 15 is quite rough. And I gotta reassign these as well. Okay, so this is definitely my 
other house tile. I can reassign these as well. Because... There's no point. And let's not starve ourselves, shall we? So this was this should work now. I mean scouts would be nice, but it's fine as long as I don't starve. Let's actually go for this. And once I have the relic, my production on wood would be really nice. I really want to upgrade the Hunter's Lodge ASAP. And I need carpentry for that and I don't have as much lore as I would be because I don't have my lore cleared. So I gotta see how I can do that. Oh nice. That's really good. I'm actually staying on food now. Maybe one scald. Because extra food is really really nice. Cause I gotta I gotta fit in a second feast here for the stoat and the raven. Both the stoat and the raven cannot feast. Oh wow, and the raven has like very interesting build order. Ah uh, This'll be a hard game, I suppose. But yeah, this this levy is pretty good, not gonna lie. So as soon as that ends, I'm going to assign these guys. And then I'll try to fit in another feast. And obviously I wanna upgrade my my main as soon as I had carpentry. Yeah, this one is getting wounded, sadly. Let's sacrifice this guy. Damn, and I got another one wounded instead. <laughs> Amazing. By the way, why why are the, the smiths not forging? This is new. I have to reassign these after getting attacked. Interesting stuff. Okay, let's build a dock right away. Since I want to wait for carpentry anyway. And I need the lore. Hmm. <clears throat> But yeah, not much scout, not much scouting going on right now. It's quite bad. So ah, uh, don't want to build it there actually. Maybe build it here. I mean, I've got no no other space for that. As sad as it is. But I want to go for another feast ASAP. So uh, dwarves are scouted, but on the op opposite of the map. Let's get the lore. And then I want to upgrade main into food, into skulls, into ships. There's the wolf. The wolf is not forged. That's good news. I'll just go ahead and click the feast button. And then after hitting carpentry, obviously I'm going to upgrade and then I'm going to get the chief and start clearing. This jar sucks by the way. It's like very, very greedy, but what can I do? No space. No space. Carpentry soon though. That's really nice.
and then the skulls. Yeah, there's a wolf scout there. Let's go for another feast soon. I mean, I need I need my second stone anyway. I have no idea where my second stone is because the the raven hasn't scouted yet. Let's hit these. Kite with this one. Reset the aggro. Feast again. Very nice. I mean, this is scouted, so I gotta watch out. I really gotta watch out. So, this second dog is a no brainer. Taking this is a no brainer. I gotta build a tower there. Nice levies from the stoat. I really like these. And yeah, one side glory of the clan, that's really nice. So my first stone is finished. I really gotta like need the second stone here like this one a lot of draugers there though pretty hard to, to clear but well anyway so I should tower my main Gotta heal the wounded wounded guy. This one was a wounded guy. And then I have to clear the draugers. Lots of nice levies. Okay, so there's my second stone as well. It's a big map, so that's nice really hard for the wolf to do anything but I will scout this regardless because it's only like five wolves two draugers to go to me don't want to risk that but I gotta prepare for the winter yeah that that makes sense that makes a lot of sense okay it's only two guys Maybe I can do something here. I will definitely contest these. Since it's only two. Should be able to do something. Maybe if he doesn't pay attention. Yeah, nice. Perfect! Perfect. Also, welcome Magnus. And since I, I saw where the uh, where the guys are spawning, I can tower that as well. Okay, so next thing I want to do is I want to clear my tomb. Yeah, yeah. 
Have a great 24 hour stream. Oh, thank you so much, man. Appreciate it. I'm pretty sure it'll be quite the ride, not gonna lie. So let's take my second food. Are you sick again? Um, do I sound sick? I, I mean, I am a little bit sick, but yes. <laughs> How, how come you notice that? Oh no. I'm a little bit sick. I'm not full sick, but I'm a, but I'm a little bit a little bit sick. Nothing nothing like too too serious though. Oh damn. It's either really bad or really good. Get well soon, brother. <laughs> Thank you, man. I mean, it's good because it's it's only two droggers on the drogger tomb. It's bad because it's uh, it has attacked my food tile. But maybe I can clear it in winter now. What's the raven doing, by the way? Not too sure. But yeah, this is nice. Also, I've got I've al uh, already got the tower for the spectrals event. Let's heal up my my chief though. I should be able to convert a lot, but do I want to convert a lot or do I just want to go for altar? Mm, let's go for this actually. Smith the sailors. Smith the hunters actually. Because I've got spare iron to forge my warriors here. Hi OP, welcome, welcome. Let's actually start to collect some food. I don't want to stop my woodcutters though. I need all the wood I, I can get. Mm. 200 for this. Let's get to 200, take the take the tomb, go for altar, go for camps. Screw the the second stone. Defend the event next. That's a pretty bad move, isn't it? But what do I know? Let's forge the warriors. If I upgrade this... I can't build ultra, so let's not do that. 
Okay, so next thing is going for camps after Altar and then we'll kill some guys. Might join you later if you don't mind. Yeah, sure. I mean, that'd be great. That'd be really, really great. I should honestly take this. But I mean it's it's so worthless. This tile is so worthless. It's just one lore stone. I'd rather just feast once. One more. Mm. Not gonna lie, these levees feel really nice. Yeah, I mean I got to I got to take the take this. Got to close my main. There's simply no way around it. Even if it feels bad. Microphone as clean as your gameplay. Oh, thank you. <laughs> thank you definitely not Pia. That's a nice comment. I mean my I really like my mic. I'm not gonna lie. It's great. Okay, so the wolf tapped out. Well. Let's start building camps. So I only need like 50 more fame and I can upgrade my second dock. Let's actually get this. So... <clears throat> I mean... Honestly, I'll just clear this and this, get this stone first. These levees hit it's so well, like, oh my god, they are great. Very, very great levees. Like Sto Stoat in particular is so strong. Yeah, let's, let's not contest this. Let's not contest this.
This actually is quite useful. Man, this this levy is really a different. Oh my god. Oh, I didn't even take sharp axes into colonization. I just went for military. Okay. Raven's pretty desperate right now. Let's go for sharp axes, why not? I will not need the happiness though. And I mean I can I can convert whenever. Honestly. I didn't take fur though, so maybe I don't want convert want to convert in winter, but after winter I will definitely convert. I've got all what I needed. These levies, they are crazy. Crazy. Let's harass a little bit. And then all I need is to convert. <clears throat> Good morning! You will stream for 24 hours now, is this true? <laughs> yes, that's true. Any tips for FFA? Try not to pick bad fights. Um, if possible, just sit back, chill. Watch what the others are doing. Let me actually like... Pay attention here. Wow, I got so lucky, considering what's like, 
Bot got hit by events. And he just tapped out. <laughs> he attacked in winter and then he just proceeded to tap out. I mean, not gonna lie, I will just take colonization here. Like way too much gold. Nice. He's a little bit salty, but I mean, it's, it makes sense. Dropping out is, it's not very, very funny. So let's let's full convert next. Let's go for the Cobalts and let's wrap this game up. And this should be it, I'm pretty sure. <laughs> Damn, you all played him. I mean, oh wow, actually, a huge fight coming up here. Let's see. I mean, I gotta enter the, the base. Okay, he enters. Wow. Let's kill the, the chief first. Nice. I lost one. Oh no. Let's reconvert. XD. Well, tips for FFA. Learn, learn a build order. Learn like one clan. And then... Um, yeah. Once you perfected that, you can you can keep playing this clan in FFA. There are some clans like Stag, like Kraken, like Boar, which scale really well for FFAs. So I would uh, suggest that you learn these first. But yeah, apart from that, um, FFA is like really really chill compared to team games. Because the games are much, much slower.
Okay, so that's uh, the stag win. And the next clan I'll play is goat. So let's actually correct that. It's one out of 17. I like how like nobody from my team converted anything. <laughs> They're just chilling. But the but the stole is oh wait, what the hell? The stole is levying, so he certainly did his part. But yeah. This is like the power of the stag. Stag is so strong once it gets rolling. Problem is, it's kind of it's kind of like slow, but it's a really really decent clan. Not OP as before, like not not as OP as before, but still really really strong. So that's a wrap. The stoat is just stoating. I mean the raven the raven scouted, the stoat levied, I feasted. Was well, still a team effort. I suppose. GG's. And just in time I got Rally. GG's.